Hi, I'm Dr. Max, and we're here today at Harry by Dr. Max Restoration Center in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. We're here today with Russ. We discussed it a while ago, having a hair restoration procedure uh, using RTAS uh, robotic technology. We plan restoration to the anterior part of the scalp, as well as the crown restoration. The procedure was successful. We finished uh, in the record time today. Everything went smoothly. We used uh, Artes robotic technology to harvest the hair follicles. Then I used sharp implanters to recreate the hairline. And as you can see evidence by before and after picture, everything went smoothly. I was able to achieve high density in where it matters and get the most natural look possible. Can you tell me how the procedure went and why you Absolutely. came here? I'm Ross Portero and, and I'm in charge of commercial operations at Venus Concept. And Venus Concept actually acquired artists as well as Neograft a couple years back and I joined the company two years ago. And so over the past two years I've watched the ev evolution of the technology uh, both with Neograft and artists for harvesting, site making and implantation. Like anybody else you know, you really can't comment on something unless you've had the procedure yourself. So I'm 60 years old and my front hairline hadn't receded too bad, um, but it certainly got thin and then absolutely a crown uh, on the back that, that needed desperate help. And so over time, you know, I've been able to watch a lot of different physicians, a lot of different videos and being in charge of commercial operations at Venus, I did have the luxury of, of, of choosing one of our, our top thought leaders and innovator, and that's in Max. And I've actually seen um, other friends and individuals that have been treated here. Um, and, and Max is a perfectionist that, that takes hair restoration to another level. And what I mean by that is, is he has all the tools. Um, so anybody coming here is going to have the ability to have an artist or neograft if, if that's their best candidate or potentially even manual FUE devices that are out there for complicated hair, curly, gray, um, whatever. But to really be a comprehensive hair restoration center, you have to have all the latest technology. And obviously, artists is, is, is kind of the franchise um, from the harvesting, from the site making and the implantation. Um, but I, I, I chose Max, um, one, he does the procedure himself, uh, two, he's an artist. Um, just drawing the hairline doesn't sound like much, but if you don't want to look like you just had a hair restoration procedure, it has to be asymmetrical, it has to be natural, and you need an artist that has done this. Um, I believe Max has been here seven years, but has been in hair restoration for well over 25, 30 years. Um, another reason I chose was Every single person you talk to about anesthesia, it's, it's a nightmare. And they say, oh, I'm so happy with my result, but you just have to gut it through the anesthesia. And you know, I'm here to say that when someone knows what they're doing and they put the anesthesia in the right plane at the right depth with the right mixture and the right spread, um, you're gonna minimize that pain. And uh, once again, Max has a very automated anesthesia gun that not only did he use for PRP to maximize the chances of the hair grafts taking quicker and regrowing, but also just the mix of lidocaine, marcaine, um, as well as just techniques with vibrator and other things to do blocks. So I'm very picky on that being in the surgical aesthetic industry for well over 30 years. And so Max did a phenomenal job on, on the aesthetic side as well. Um, the grafts here, are actually treated better than children. Okay, not only the PRP before, but the PRP when we're doing the implantation, to the PRP, to the hairs that are harvested that immediately go in the PRP, to going to the back table with the microscope, with the chilled table that once again, Max also is kind of an engineer and innovator. So um, I, didn't choose, I didn't choose this site by accident. I wanted to maximize the results both on art and science, uh, which many people don't know. That's the uh, acronym for artists of art and science. And, and I think uh, Max epitomizes that. So I couldn't be more pleased. This is day one. 
and stay tuned for three months, six months, and nine months. This yeah. is the fresh experience. We just finished the procedure, right? So yeah. Uh, thank you so much. Max, thank you. Couldn't be happier. I appreciate it.